Well, I had to go to Kitty and Jose's room because it then got to be very late. It was going, it was originally like around 6, 6.30, and it now was getting on to be 7, 8 o'clock. And I was extremely hungry. It's been a long day. And I knocked on Kitty's door of their room, and Kitty was in the room, but there was no Jose. And she said that he was down in Eric's room. Did Eric have a room in the same hotel? Yes, he did. If I can remember right, it was like about two to three rooms down from their room. Okay. So she told you that Jose's in Eric's room? Correct. What happened then? She then said that we had to wait until Jose came out of Eric's room before we could go to dinner. So, so did, did you wait in her room or return to your room? No, I went back to my room. And did you subsequently get information that Jose was now back? What had happened was I had to go there one more time. I, I went back to her room and said, you know, Kitty, it's really getting very late. Why don't we just go down to eat? And she said, no, no, it'll only be a few more moments. Jose should be coming out of his room. And how much time before Jose did come out of Eric's room? If I can remember right, it was like around 8.30 or quarter to 9. And what happened then? We then were walking down the hallway and... When you say we. Oh, I'm sorry. It okay. was uh, Kitty, myself... Brian and Jose, the four of us. Okay. And what happened then was we said we would like to go in and see Eric to at least tell him that we thought the game was very well. We were sorry that he lost. Jose made fun of that, but as we were there, there in front of the room, he said, well, okay, Eric is in his room, and he will not be coming to dinner with us. So he opened the room, and Who as he... opened the room? Uh, Jose did. Did he have it, a key? Yes. Mm-hmm. And when he opened the room, he, uh, we looked in, and, and it was a short hallway like you would have like in a Holiday Inn or something like that. We then, I looked in the room, and it was di very dimly lit, and Eric was in bed. How did he look? He looked very sad, and it, it, you could tell something was wrong with him, okay? He didn't want to speak to us, and um, I was going to go over and give him a hug, and I was told that I shouldn't do that, that... Eric just didn't want people to hug him.